it's good to have you back with us on the cafe. Now, Chang Hung is best known for his crazy pranks on the Edge radio station, like streaking naked down Queen Street and even proposing to his fiancée live on air. Now he's showing us a more serious side, however, by entering local body politics. Chang's one of the seven City Vision candidates running for positions on the Waitemata local board. Nice to have you fully closed on the show, Chang. Great to actually you to be here, even. Oh, no, thanks for having yeah. me, and Hi, Mel. It's really nice. Hi, Chang. Yeah. It's nice to see you, and I'm yeah. glad you went to an effort and made it, you know, dressed up nicely. I know he's in a suit. I'm never yeah, well, you're trying to say I'm not in the three-quarter pants and basketball singlet. That's, how I see you. That's how we usually see you because we've both worked with Chang at mm -hmm. different times over the years. Mm -hmm. It's really nice to see you in here in a suit, mm -hmm. not in the kitchen. I don't I know, know if that was nice for anyone. No, <laughs> I think we made, I think we made a mess there. <laughs> Poor Mark. Yeah. That is not happening ever again. Yeah. But so tell me what is going on in your life. What's happening? Well, so I'm running like for local politics, so for the Waitemata local board. So me and my candidates, the City Vision candidates, which is a combination of Labour, Greens, and Communist independence going to challenge the seven seats that's available in the local so elections. Not a prank. You're not doing this for any sort of radio stunt. Which this is definitely past. not a radio stunt. You so are yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm very passionate about the area that I live in, which is Waitamata. So that's the reason why I'm giving it a go. So and yeah, so we'll, we'll never know, we'll know, won't know what happens until September. So that's when the voting papers come out and you get to do a postal vote, just like how you did for the uh, flag referendum. Okay. I've known you for a long time, Chang. When you're oh, driving... my, some people say too long. <laughs> yeah, <true. laughs> no, when you're driving around your local area yeah. what is it that annoys you about it well obviously within the Waitamata area yeah. transport so okay. transport, but you, you can see so much work is being done at the moment with the CRL so the, I'm really happy about that happening and it'll take some time but it will it'll be awesome once it's built so so I know, I know Mel just asked you this question, mm. but I'm still intrigued. Why do you want to go from having fun on a radio station to running the city? I mean, ugh. Well, it's not, it's not really running the city, so I'm not going for not a councillor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm with the local board, so it's more a representation of the community to the council. Right. So I'm like the middleman. So you, you have your communities, and then you have the local boards, and then local boards connect the community with the council. So that's and, basically what I'm doing. And you are really serious about it too, aren't you? Because you've put your wedding on hold. Oh, where did you get that from? Don't say that too loud. She's, she's sitting somewhere you in the crowd. Too, you're just <laughs> your gorgeous fiance, yeah. and, and you, so you actually, so you really are serious about that. No, we're very serious about it. Yeah, we, we have a good think about it, and then we, we ran into our local MP just into doing during uh, New Year's festival, and it was like, oh, I really want to give it a go. She put me to the right people, and then that's where me and City Vision is going to challenge its seven seats. So. Are you worried that people aren't going to take you seriously because you are Chang? I'm, I'm very serious. I'm very yeah. So, but yeah, but but that's why I come on shows like this and talk about it. So right. like, because Mike, you actually live in my area, so the White Town region. So who are you going to vote oh, for? So you just get spruce in for both. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right here. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, can I test you on something then? Uh oh. Okay. Can you go. put an um, order of importance for me yeah. since you are in my area? Yeah. Uh, transport, mm -hmm. building, immigration, and environment. When, Put them in order. When, for when you say building, what, so you mean housing? Yeah, I'm talking about the yeah. way the council, you know, takes forever to get permits for anything, and yeah. there's consents and resource management tax. You know, oh. we need to obviously sort that That's out. That's touched it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's touched <laughs> very deep now with Mike Peru. <laughs> so what's more important? Go those four: transport, mm -hmm. building. Mm -hmm. Immigration and environment. So I think all of them are important. You can't you can't really put them all in order because then someone will felt mi uh, missed out. So I think they are all very important issues. So that answer like a true politician. And that Chang. One, a true politician. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna do well. I would have liked to have seen you in a hat with vote chain or something on it. Oh, or like, yeah. a, or like, um, like one of those T-shirts. Oh, so, so oh, well, we'll think about it. I'll talk to my campaign manager and we'll make that happen. Or well, at least Ooh. a little. What are those little flat? What are those things called? Those little, little ribbons. Yeah, yeah. ribbons, ribbons for my face. So, yeah, yeah. I, we're waiting for one to be made by City Vision. So, I think yeah, that'll hopefully. be really, really good. Yeah. So what? What should? Why should people vote for you? Well, because I'm, I'm really passionate about our community, and not only me, my, my other board members, uh, candidates is running for it, they're very passionate about the, the place we live, and we want to represent the community. So if you haven't enrolled, it's very simple, just go on to the Electoral uh, Commission and just enroll there. If you change address, that means you have moved electorate, so you have to check all that information correct before the postal votes get sent out in September. This sounds so. awful, but I'm not even entirely sure what electorate I'm in. Are you even enrolled, Mel? Oh, I'm definitely enrolled. Okay, that's good. Did you yeah. vote for the flag? Yes. Okay, so it's exactly oh, yeah, the same I'm, way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm definitely. Yeah, but yeah. I can't remember my electorate because um, it changed a couple of years ago, and we went from one area to another. Oh, yeah. I can't remember. Oh, yeah. mm. Hopefully, fingers crossed, you're in my region. 
No, I yeah. might be. There you go. Well, Ch I wanted to say, Chang, the best of luck, because um, I do know you. Mm -hmm. I think you've got a big heart. Mm -hmm. I know that you bought your first house and you moved your parents into yeah. it. Yeah, so, so that says you care about people mm -hmm. and their living environments. Mm -hmm. um, and you're very clever, too, because you bought an apartment. and not say that too loud. You know, you just know you're good with your money. And I'm a tight ass also. <laughs> and, and you don't drink as well, you know, so you're the yeah. perfect candidate. Yeah, thanks, mate. Your, your radio persona can be quite different to your actual persona. I think yeah. you'll do really, really well. Hey, Chang, it's been an absolute pleasure. Okay. Good. Have you on the show? Thank you. Can I just trick out now? No, no, I'm just... not yet. <laughs> no, no, no. Sit there and do not move. Best of luck, Chang.